it's me. I'm testing the microphone. What's up? Hey guys, it's Meg and I am now one year older doing a birthday haul. I didn't actually think of this as a idea for a video as an idea um, until I started getting like requests, like comment requests. So before I get into it and show you guys all the presents I got for my birthday, I thought it wouldn't be fair to... I mean, it's kind of a big deal. I can barely lift it, so kind of a big deal, kind of. But yeah, stay tuned to the end. At the end of this video, I'm actually gonna unbox it and show you guys everything that's in it, which is so exciting. It's the easiest contest in the world. You literally just comment your favorite thing in the box. You'll see me unbox it. I'm getting excited just thinking about it. Um, and you subscribe to both our channels, and then you just, yeah, already explained it. Oh my God, it's that easy. And yeah, let's get into the video. So, that being said, I'm gonna jump right into this because I'm having like a panic attack. It's a race against time because it's getting darker slowly. I had an amazing, amazing, amazing birthday. The last two years I've been in school and this year I went to Malibu. So, that's kind of a really big difference. I let myself like sleep in a couple hours and I go downstairs and there's a sign. Lainey had put a sign on the door that said, Happy Birthday, Meg. And it was such, like, I don't even know how to describe it. Like, it was such an unexpected thing. I got like, so 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 happy right away and I was like well that's it this birthday is going to be amazing so um, I saw that and then the second thing I did was make myself coffee and that does not sound like it's some amazing thing but so I made myself coffee I was like drinking it on my mug like getting ready for the day and I look and it's like and there's like really cute crayons on my mug and I've drinking it out of this mug before and it says happy birthday on it and I was like ha huh? That is hilarious. I hadn't noticed that like any other day I had drank it out of that cup. I had just seen crayons. And that day I read the happy birthday. So it's the little things, guys. And I went to Malibu with a few YouTube friends and we just spent the night and it was really, really fun. Okay, oh, that's my little Polaroid sitting on the bed behind me. It's so cute. I'm just gonna leave it there. Um, all right, so this is in no particular order at all. But the first one is, sorry, I'm making so much noise with the paper. It's from my roommate. So not only did she do the happy birthday sign, oops, she gave me this present. It came in this adorable bag. It's purple and it says, Paris on it and there were three things in there there was a card which I'm not obviously gonna read it was super super amazing and long and heartfelt and I feel like I haven't like I wasn't expecting anything and it was just amazing and then I got this from her and it says everything is sweeter when it's shared with a friend and it just made me really really happy and of course it matches my room perfectly so I actually had, had it like right in like one of those little cubbies near my bed so I'm gonna put it back I just wanted to show you guys the bag that it came in and everything and then Oh shoot, I don't know where I've put this because I've used it like every day since. Oh, it's been found. Okay, the next thing is this vanilla smelling lotion. Vanilla cream, hand cream. It says cream twice. Um, and it smells really good. I wish you guys could smell it. I always wish you guys could smell or taste or touch the things that I experience, but I'm gonna put some on right now because it makes me really happy and it smells really good. And it is, it's like perfume, but it's also like lotion. So yeah, that was amazing and just like a really cool start to my day. The next thing I got, okay, this is literally in order of when I got them. So my grandma, my mom, my sister, my dad, everyone who knows I'm a little bit forgetful sometimes, called me the day before my birthday and said, okay Meg, you have something important to do tomorrow. You have to go to this bakery and pick, no, they didn't even tell me what it was. They were like, you have to go somewhere and pick something up. And I'm like, uh, like, okay, I know it's my birthday, it's something, but like, it was so vague. And they all called me, so like, to make sure I would remember. And then the, in the morning, I figured out where I had to go, and I go to this bakery. It's like my favorite local bakery. And my Grammy has had them make a caramel apple cake.
Then because, oh, I bought myself a coffee maker and I text my mom like a couple days later and I was like, I got myself one finally. Turns out she had got me one for my birthday, but um, it ended, like I was gonna, I was like, okay, it's fine, like I'll return one, like I just got it. It was like half boxed up in my room. And then, like on my, the day of my birthday, it turns out she had actually returned hers and shipped me from Amazon. I get this like huge Amazon package full of different types of coffee, like little Keurig coffee things. There's pumpkin spice, there's Caribbean, there's donut shop, there's French roast, there's Spanish roast, there's Colombian, there are so many amazing coffee things. Italian, I don't know if I said Italian here, but that was perfect because all I had was coffee that like come with my Keurig and some Colombian, so that was awesome. And next, I took a walk. This was, I took a walk on my birthday, the best present. Um, no, to take like all my birthday calls. And mind you, it was like, it was definitely higher than 30 degrees and I was sweating and like complaining on the phone to people in different countries who were like get over it You're in California, and I'm like, but you don't get it. I'm like melting today Um, and so yeah, I went to just take my birthday calls and then I got to talk to my Nona Which was amazing and then my mom texted me pictures of the card because she gives me a card and money for my birthday and Christmas every year So instead of me being there to get the card and the money Which like is usually the case because I was usually in Germany or something like that My mom texted me a picture of it, and it was so cool The next thing I got was a really really pretty Kate Spade bracelet from Megan and it looks like this and I think it's so so pretty I wanted to wear it, but then I didn't want it to jingle while I was talking, but that's really really sweet And I keep it in the little pouch it came in. Huh. It felt like I was rushing for that video I'm sorry I'm just really excited to open this box So I'm gonna be doing the official unboxing and showing you guys everything that is inside Let's open this guy up Okay, so there's a bunch of Beautiful party stuff, which I was about to just throw all over my floor, but I will regret that later. The first thing we have is an adorable Lulu skirt. Ooh, it looks like that. It has fake pockets? Nope, it doesn't have any pockets. Okay, just kidding. And it looks adorable. Okay, the next thing is a... Ooh, a makeup bag. I like, I like. Okay, I thought it was pink at first, but it's orange. It looks orange now. And let's get to the next thing. Yay, daily look. Sorry, I get excited. I'm obsessed with daily look. And it is a, I have no nails and I have to open this the long way. A necklace, yeah, okay. It's, oh my God, wow. I love it. It's gorgeous. And it's light too. That's nice. My floor is like a mess right now. But I mean, that's what happens when you're opening presents. Okay, don't freak out. Okay, you can totally freak out. Juicy Couture Lala perfume. In the flavor? Nope, not flavor. In the scent, Malibu. Hey, Malibu! My birthday. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. I don't know what it smells like, but I love Malibu and Malibu smells cool. So, I mean, it kind of smells salty and like fish and like the ocean, but. I'm pretty sure this won't smell like fish, so you're in luck. The next thing is, is it another skirt? <gasps> no, it's a blouse. Ooh, okay, we got a Lulu's blouse. Guys, look. Oh, oh my gosh, wait, I used to have something kind of like this and it was strapless. This is freaking adorable. This is really cute. Wow. The next thing is, oh cool, a shell of manicure. Oh, are you getting this? Are you getting this? A real crushed shell nails. Siate, London, I'm sorry, I do not know how to pronounce that. Um, sh I was gonna try again, but nothing came out of my mouth. Okay, Kie, Siate or Kiate or Kate. Maybe it's Kate. Kate London. <laughs> And it's about uh, guys, how to, okay, what he really thinks about flirting, dating, relationships, and you. Well, I'm not gonna read this. I'm totally not gonna read this. The next thing is, oh, that's awkward. Don't you ever feel bad when you're like at Christmas, your birthday or something, and like you just open the present and it was like really awesome, but like you just have to check if there's something else in there because there's still like wrapping paper, and you like have to casually like check like as if you're not looking for another present because you don't want to seem like you're like you need something else because you don't. You just need to know if there's another package in there. Yeah, that just happened to me and it was a little awkward. This is cool too. Cool. So now we have an empty 17 cylinder box that I can now lift. It was so heavy before. And make sure to follow me on the Twitter and the Instagram and Facebook and Tumblr and what else? 
yeah, may maybe I should stop. But I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. I know this wasn't the most like elaborate video or full of tips and advice or anything, but it was so fun to make and it's fun to share these little bits of my life with you, and especially when I get to give things away. So I will see you guys later. I love you very much. And if you're going to BeautyCon, I guess I'll see you today. Peace.